Um, I, I don't think it was uh, initially it was a conscious decision um, to for it to end up the way it ended up. Um, like with your first album, you've got so long to write it and experiment with different things, and um, I think the first album captures that really well because there's there's so many different elements of, of rock music. And what we want to do is definitely be seen as a, as a band that's trying to continue the legacy of guitar bands and take it somewhere a little bit different. Um, and we just started writing, like, like we were saying, we just always write. And um, it became apparent when you're writing in a very short space of time um, that there's something that like holds these ideas together. There's a, there's a theme that runs through it, I think, anyway. Um, and um, and that year that we started writing in, in sort of 2016, um, well, these, these ideas that ended up being the second album, so much had happened in the world, um, and it was just coming out lyrically as well, um, and became really, really uh, essential in, in making this album. So I think on some levels it, it's it's really not just captured Tax the Heat at the moment, I think it's really uh, captured a moment in time generally as well. One thing that we really kind of uh, thought about when we were going into this record, we always think about how the songs are going to come across live and that's what we really want to do. We really want to make songs to be able to go out there and just put on the best live show that we possibly can and songs that are going to come across really well live. And I think having done the first record and being able to play those songs loads of times uh, on loads of tours that we've done since then has given us a much better idea of uh, what bits to, to keep and what bits to lose from songs to, to make it come across the way that we want it to live. I think, we... I think that kind of uh, the diverseness of, uh, of what we've put into this record. I just can't wait to get out and play a lot of these songs live, and it's gonna. I just know it's gonna make for such a great set list and stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, and I think we were really thinking. Well, I think um, in the guitar world, especially, I think me and JP, we really thought even more about parts and in, in regards to sound and uh, coming up with really bizarre guitar sounds that you just like you've never heard so that that was that was really exciting writing riffs and and genuinely feeling like I haven't heard that guitar sound before that's really crazy and then a, a, a song would come out of it so I think like you never really know and hindsight is a wonderful thing but right now it feels like it has really captured us um, at a point that we might even look back on and think that was that was even more like the beginning of Tax the Heat than, than the first album. You feel alone, even when you're sitting in the crowd.